Hello guys, gals, and non-binary pals. Thank you for tuning into the channel. On today's episode, we're going to take a look at this new product from Army Painter called the Game Master Dungeons and Caverns Core Set. This is a terrain box manufactured by the Army Painter. They sent it to me to do a review, so let's get to it. Here's the picture of the front. This artwork is really nice. Beautiful, beautiful artwork. I would also like to thank the Army Painter for thinking of me and sending this awesome terrain making kit, especially since I'm a smaller YouTube channel. And also congratulations Army Painter for winning the Regional Initiative Award from Dutch Industry. Look at all this fun stuff. Endless hours of adventure await you. Hold your shield and hold it high, for monsters will be monsters. Strike with force upon the head or tame the beast. Tame the beast. And I am really looking forward to making some stairs. I'm not the best at those, so I'm curious to see their technique. All right, enough uh, jibber jabber, I suppose. More exciting packaging design. Look at that side stuff. Ooh. And here we go. I don't even know what this are. It's like Raiders of the Lost Ark. And it's just going, ha. Ah. It's like everything you could ever want in a kit to make terrain. Ah, oh, neat little card. In your hands, you hold one of the very first Game Master Dungeons and Caverns core sets ever made. Game Master is an entirely new range of products from the Army Painter, and we are really proud and excited about what we have created for you. Therefore, we have included a small present just for you, a free effect brush and a crypt upgrade kit you can use in your role-playing adventures. Awesome. We sincerely hope you enjoy your journey through the included guidebook and hope you'll share your own creations with us on social media. Okay, it is on. Okay, so first up, the first thing I grabbed is a terrain primer and it's a rattle can terrain primer, which looks like you can use this on foam. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at this gravel and grit i get a lot of questions from people when i make terrain videos where do you get your bits your gravelly bits well here's a chance to get some really nice patio paver type style gravel people are always like where do you get your patio paver i get it at the hardware store but army painter is sending this in their kit tufts if you've ever watched my terrain videos you know i love these things probably more than uh, sliced bread. Okay, and here here is the hot foam cutter. I'm not very good with hot foam cutters. I tend to break the wires a lot. So I'll, I'll use this and show it on camera, but let's not be surprised if I snap some wires and things. Here's the cavern base. It's awesome. It's a nice chunk of product in there too. And the dungeon base, which I think are probably a Acrylic paints in my uh, my estimate. Paint brushes. There is the straight edge and the mixing. Oh, yes. Thank you so much for these. I really am always in need of brushes, and I really do love my favorite dry brush that was like this. I couldn't. I lost. I took it to a game store and I lost it. I know. I know. It's probably in my car. <laughs> oh my goodness, yes. Okay, digging in deeper. Here's another brush. I guess this is the extra brush they were talking about. The Game Master Effect brush. Yes, that's the Game Master Effect brush. And I thought I would take a look at what's inside the box of brushes. So Army Painter is giving us 
a variety of brushes. Oh, I'm so excited about this one. The large dry brush, yes. Don't worry brushes, I'm sure I'm gonna love all of you equally. It just, I really do enjoy a good dry brush. Oh, I feel those bristles. So the brushes that we get, large, we get a large dry brush, a wash brush, an effects brush, and a medium dry brush. I will say those, those are nice, very nice bristles. Here's the straight edge that we get. I tend to snap these. And here's a nice mixing palette for your paints. So cool. Thank you, Army Painter. This is awesome. Here's the ruler, which I'm very happy because it has inches and millimeters. And that's awesome. For someone who is metrically challenged, like any typical American, I think that's awesome. Thank you, Army Painter. <gasps> Did they give train pieces? Oh my God, they gave us train pieces. Little plastic train pieces. Army Painter, thank you. It's a trap door. Oh my goodness, it is on. It looks like a tomb of some kind, which is great. A ladder, a trap door. Ah, oh, these are awesome. And a little greebly of some kind. Oh, it looks like a lever. Ah, oh, that's awesome. So I, pr I guess this is what comes with when they say uh, Crypt Upgrade Kit. So this would probably be, guess, the Crypt Upgrade Kit. If we, this white stuff I'm touching is the foam. I don't know if this is an XPS foam, but we'll take a look at that in a minute. And here are all the paints that you get. Let's see what colors we get. So we have Cavern Highlights, Dungeon Effects, Dungeon Highlights, Grotto Slime, Brink Black, ooh, that sounds interesting. Cavern Effects, and subter Subterrain Wash. Also, I have no idea why I just whispered that, but that brink black does sound really intriguing. And then here's some foam sculpting glue, which to me just kind of looks like, oh, maybe a white PVA glue. I have no, I have no clue about the glue. I'll have to find out. Um, what is this? Oh, thank you. That is so awesome. Well, thank you. Actually, Pet Army Painter, thank you. So there are some set of paints. I really look forward to this the brink black. I wonder if that's close to like the black that takes out all the white. Oh my goodness. Okay, so here is the how-to book. It is pretty thick. It's a really good quality book. Uh, the artwork and the photography is top-notch. Yeah, this is a very nice book. Ooh, mod, this looks modular. That's awesome. I look forward to this. Oh, look, all sorts of techniques. How to make dungeon tiles, how to weather them. Oh, this is awesome. Great job, Army Painter. I'm so excited. Look, you can make your crags and your hills. Oh, great. This is awesome. This is an awesome kit. Look how beautiful that looks. That is a beautiful. Man, great job. Army Painter, this is awesome. Adding decorations. Terrain. Oh my goodness, yes. Make a lava lake. Look at that. Beautiful. This book is full of information on how to use all the cool stuff that you get. Y yay, Army Painter. This is very exciting. Very, very exciting, Army Painter. Love the how-to. Here's the foam. Um, I'm gonna have to see what I think about this foam. This is different than American foam, I think. I don't know. I don't, I don't. We'll see, uh, uh, interesting. 
I've never worked with a foam like this. I usually work with the XPS foam. So look at all this. Look at all the foam you get. You can definitely make a little scenario out of all this. I'm gonna make stairs. You get two, two stacks of foam this size and then you get foam that's practically the size of the bottom of the box. Look at that. You can't really see, it's like white on white, but there's the foam. So you get a lot of foam. This box is filled with good stuff. And here's the sandpaper for weathering your foam. Army Painter, thank you once again for sending me this awesome terrain making kit. I'm really looking forward to using it. Also very excited to delve deeper into your terrain making guidebook and experiment with some of the things that you're showing us how to do. I may even do that on this channel. From what I can gather, the MSRP is between 60 to $100. 65 bucks, it's a great price for this. Even $100 is a great price for this. And I'm really curious, I'm really curious about this. An aerosol primer spray that does not melt foam, that's amazing. We'll see how it works. Maybe I'll just do a little tutorial on just this. If you've watched my channel at all, you know I love the Army Painter Tufts. So I'm really looking forward to these. I don't know if they're showing up on the camera, but I'm gonna try and get them in focus. Nope. All right, everyone, I guess that's the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching till the end. Go ahead, hit the like, subscribe button, and all the doobly-doos. And um, check out the description box below. I'm currently running another Kickstarter to fund some of our miniatures. Uh, if you'd like to support that, that's much appreciated. Stay safe out there, everyone. Have a good one, and I'll talk to y'all later.